Hi. Uh, hello. Nope. See, <laughs> I was trying to do a Scandinavian and it always comes out the same you can't way. can't talk Scandinavian. It's Scandinavia is a conglomerate of different countries. I know, but I was just trying to think. So of let's something. open the box and see what countries. This is a box that is. Well, first of all, I'm Cindy. Did That's we do that Debbie. Again? No. Dang it. Yeah. We're sisters and stitches. Welcome to our channel. Hey. We do Debbie, more than food. Cindy. Yeah, I did that already. But, you did, Debbie. Yeah. Cindy. <laughs> <laughs> we do do more than food boxes, so check out our channel. We do tons of stuff. But we had done this box for a while, and then I kind of got rid of it to bring other boxes in, and I missed the taste testing. And I know you guys love it. So it is Universal Yums. And I just got the smaller box because they have five to seven snacks from wherever their country is that they're doing that month. And that's $15. And then you can go up from 10 to 12, which is 25. And then you can go up another size, depending on how big your family is. Or Food boxes gathering. are always fun to send to people, too. Like your kids at college or kids that live across the country like mine do. This would be a really fun box to say, hey, I sent you some foods from, you know, blah, blah, blah. Wherever they're Well, there was a couple one. boxes that we had where the food wasn't so wow. good. And I saved them for my grandkids <coughs> just to see their faces. So anyway, this is the smaller box. And it comes like this. So you know where it's coming from. And then here's Scandinavia. They give you a, a little snippet of where Yeah, they do with from. every box. And so that's, that's more of just, a, yeah, like a map. They have a little game card for the kids on the other side. And then they usually give you a sticker of where the box is from. So here it is underneath all the paperwork. So looks like we've got to make the chips. So we've got some Kim's corn curl snacks. So they look like our Cheetos. And this whole bag is 130 calories. And these chips are from I think they're from Norway. Well, it just says it's got a mix of Danish spices. But I think they're, let's see where they're from. Oh, New Jersey, but they're made in Denmark. Okay. And these are a caramel flavor that's made from whey cheese puff. What? I mean, it tastes like, what are those, like, little, they're, they do, they're not Cheetos. Those hot fries, or those regular cheese fries things, those sticks. Mm -hmm. Candy cap. All right. Hmm. These are pretty good. Okay. I'm a fan of these. Okay. And then, I think by the same company, Kim's, we get the American Grilled Potato Chips. So, this will be very interesting to see what they think American potato chips taste like. They're paprika and chili pepper potato chips. American inspired. And these were made in Denmark. And the whole bag is 130 calories. It doesn't smell too good, but... I like these. I'm not even a big chip person. You like them? When I'm eating them, I don't really taste them until I the the you taste it after you swallow it. Like, mm -hmm. they're good. Yeah, I'm not trying to get it out, but I want to cleanse my palate so I can taste the next thing. All right, so that was the second one. The third snack we have looks like a candy bar. This is a, nougat, a, Yan a, a Yankee a nougat and licorice milk chocolate bar. Tastes like Milky Way with a salty surprise. Okay. And this is from probably Denmark. I don't know. What's saying Danish again? Yeah, Denmark is Danish. Okay. So this is the Yankee Lakrid. <laughs> I don't know about nougat and licorice milk. Well, what? you might like it. But you gotta try it. That's part of the deal. I get the box. Here's kind of what it looks like. It look, kind of looks like a Milky Way bar. But the licorice milk is throwing me for a loop. It does. It looks like a Milky Way bar. 
It's like a Three Musketeers with the Milky Way Center. You can taste the licorice. Yeah. And this whole bar is 230 calories. Ooh. I love licorice, so I think it's great. Licorice and chocolate? Ooh. Oh. Wow, wow, that tastes really good. Ah. What's the matter there, sissy? Oh my gosh. Mixed fruit licorice stick. Well, this, this is, is from Copenhagen, Tom's. Denmark. Yeah, I think these are all from Denmark. But this is a soft candy stick. Yeah, it's called mixed fruit licorice stick. More licorice. Maybe they like licorice over there. Keep some regular. It's Copenhagen's chewish fondant filled secret. Cut fondant. That. Who eats fondant? I always peel that off the cakes before I eat the cake. All right, and there's what it looks like in the center. Okay. It's like red licorice with a little bit of filling inside. No. Yeah, it does. It's good. No, well, now not. I know I can live in Denmark. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I think it's really good. That's brutal. I don't know if I like these, but these are Karen Wolf Original Oat Cookies with Cocoa Filling. And each cookie is 110 calories. It says, warning, this is not your average chocolate chip cookie. In this Danish version, bittersweet chocolate binds two crispy oat cookies together to make an extraordinary treat. It's only fitting for the equally extraordinary story of how the cookie came to be. In 1864, Karen Wolf was born in an impoverished village in Denmark. As a teen, she worked in a kitchen, learning how to be both a chef and a businesswoman. By age 26, she saved enough money to fulfill her dream and open a bakery. Her products quickly won over Copenhagen socialites. Her business exploded and Karen Wolf became a household name in Denmark. That was 125 years ago. So it's like two flat wafer cookies with some chocolate in the middle. I mean, it's more like a cracker. Mm. Now see, I like this. This is good. How soon no. you can eat that licorice chocolate bar and not like these? I'm just flabbergasted. I don't like, I don't think I like the crackery cookie part. Hmm. And then we got a little bag and usually they put like little candies in there or yeah, something. Yeah, so there's cocoa mud cake balls in there and wild strawberry toffee. I love toffee. All right, so we each get a piece. So here is the toffee. I'll give you one of those. And then here is whatever she said. This is the cocoa mud cake balls. And those were all, these are all made in Denmark as well? Yeah. Uh -huh. Well, no, no the, this Sweden. These uh, are from Sweden. 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 All right, I'm going for the strawberry. Why don't we just so we don't open both of them? Nah. Ugh. Mm. The taffy is really good. It's more like um, the salt water taffy that you... I'm going to be chewing that forever. The cake ball is... It's like a malted milk ball, but not as crunchy. Yeah. It's like the outer coating of the malted milk ball. Mm-hmm. And this is just like salt water taffy. Yeah, it's that. exactly like salt water taffy. So, wasn't that fun? We got a little trip to Scandinavia. Some Denmark, some stuff from Sweden. I'm a fan. I like the chips. I like the candy. Did not like the cookies. Now, Debbie, see, I like the cookies more than anything. And you didn't like any of the other snacks? I like the chip, the the potato oh. chips, but I didn't like the licorice candy and the corn, the corn curls I thought were just like eating styrofoam. Oh. See how everybody's taste is different? I enjoyed our little trip to Scandinavia. So 
Stay it tuned next month. To see uh -huh. what comes from other countries. I wonder what they do when they see what we snack on. Well, when I they call the this the American chips, but it's more of a like a spicy. Well, it says American inspired. Oh. All right. Well, like I said, it's a nice way to, you know, maybe if you're homeschooling to get this box and incorporate wherever it's from into your lesson plan. Yeah, because, I mean, they sent you a really cute booklet with it, all, like, facts and stuff about about Sweden. And they, like, they have little puzzles you can do. So it's a really fun um, activity to, to do, do with your kids. For grandkids or nieces or nephews. So... All right, that was our breakfast. So we're gonna get going. We gotta go Liquor's get our nails chocolate. done because we took off our nails. Our hands look terrible. So we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for tuning into our foods from Scandinavia. <laughs> I'm a fan, she's not. I know where I can live overseas. Looks so. like you can get all these through New Jersey. If you're interested, you can order them. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.